Welcome, welcome, everybody. I am so excited because today is the best day ever. This is the day where we host our dollar event. I'm so pumped. And if you guys are new to our dollar event, don't you worry. I'm going to explain everything in just a few minutes. So as you guys are joining in this morning, make sure you guys tell me hello. Let me know where you guys are crafting from. And if you guys are excited about this dollar event, hit those dollar signs down below. So give me a one, give me a dollar sign, give me some fun emojis down below. Hello. We're doing some Halloween stuff, so maybe some pumpkins. So I know that you guys are just as ready. So um, we're going to go ahead and get ready to dive right in. All right, so let's go ahead and start off right away announcing that we are going to do a giveaway here. So we're going to do a $15 store credit. So if you want a chance to win $15 store credit, which is going to allow you guys to, um, especially... If you guys are a plus member, you're going to have extra access to this event an extra 24 hours. You guys could go back and purchase some things from this. Maybe buy a bundle or buy something from the marketplace. You choose. So $15 store credit. All you have to do is use hashtag Halloween in the comments below for a chance to win. And we'll draw somebody here in just a bit. So as you guys are joining in, like I said, hello, hello. Welcome in. I am so excited. I see all of those hellos. I am so here for this. I love crafting with you guys in the morning time too, because I get to see some of those faces I don't get to see on my Mondays live. So hello, hello, here we go. So let's go ahead and jump into our deals. And let me show you what we got this month. So you guys know that we have 42 designs. So let's go ahead. Let me pull up my screen. Give me two seconds. There we go. All right. So I'm going to go ahead on my side, I'm going to make this a little bit bigger here so you guys can see this. So inside of here is 42 designs and they are a dollar. So you guys can see that here. So $1, if you guys are new to our dollar event, these are ginormous bundles that you guys can get for one buck. So this is a perfect opportunity to snag up and build up your um, SVGs and PNGs and all that. Whether you have a Cricut, Silhouette, Glowforge, um, you guys have Procreate and Fonts. It, we have you covered across the board. Sublimation, they're here. So we've got a mixture between some fall, Halloween, and Christmas stuff. So um, let's go ahead and dive in here. We've got a few videos, too, that we've pre-recorded ahead of time if you guys need to see any of that. So I really love this one right here. Look how cute this is. I'm not a hugger. Um, the only... The only BS I need is beer and sunshine. So that one is super, super cute. We've got some fall signs here. We've got uh, these ones right here are really adorable. And I've actually done a bleach t-shirt with this one before. Um, and I really wish I would have grabbed that link before we got started so I could show you all that. But we have done a bleach t-shirt. My daughter wears all the time on that one. We're going to be doing some of those on a coffee mug today. So if you guys did not read the title, we are going to do coffee mugs today. So we're going to be supplementing with our Cricut mug press. Um, let's see here. We're going to be using this little bundle right here as well so so cute once again we don't talk about gnomes inside the studio because last time we had some spooky stuff go on our h fell down so we've got some gnomes going on in here um we've got some really huge christmas bundles here so if you click on these inside of here is a ton of fun stuff so make sure you guys really click these bundles and dig around in here and see what all is included because it's just loaded for a dollar guys one dollar i know i get so excited over this all right so i'm gonna go ahead and keep on moving along we've got some laser stuff now keep in mind with our laser stuff you don't have to just have a glow forge you can still use that stuff on your cricket as well um let's see we're going to scroll right along here. These are so cute. It is homecoming time. So these are perfect to place on a t-shirt, coffee mugs, all of the things. I'm going to zoom us back out here. We've got some really fun um, signs. So you guys know, I do believe our last dollar event, we did some of these really fun signs. So you guys can definitely go back and check that video out. But look at how cute this turkey is. There is so many good ones in here. Once again, a dollar. Now, let me also explain. If you guys are a plus member, you guys get extra access. So if you're not a plus member, you have one hour. Once this event starts, which is going to be starting in 53 minutes, once this event starts, you have one hour to completely check out. So even if you have it added in your cart, make sure you completely check out within that hour. But if you're a plus member, you should have something that says after party, which means you have an extra 24 hours to make up your mind. So you get 24 instead of one hour. All right, let me go ahead and keep on scrolling here. We've got some Christmas stickers here. Oh, now when it comes to stickers like this, which I'm going to show you one of them today, don't just think about stickers. You can sublimate with these as well. Put them on t-shirts, pillowcases, coffee mugs, all of the things. Anything with a PNG, you guys can do all of that stuff with. Print them out with Cricut, sublimation. 
So we have, let's see, going through here, some more Christmas bundles here. We've got those really fun pin wraps. Um, this is such a cute doodled out alphabet. So you bring in these pieces here and then you could put the kiddos. It even almost reminds me of an embroidery type look. Um, you know how you take that fabric. It's just so stinking darling. So I love that. We're going to be using this one today on the coffee mug. So I'm going to show you guys that these are stickers, but I'm going to use them on the coffee mug because remember with sublimation, white, there is no white ink. So um, with this one, we're, we, we can still use them to sublimate. So just kind of scrolling along here, we've got so much cute stuff. This one right here, those Halloween signs, once again, uh, we've got the Christmas bags. Oh my gosh. You guys let me know in the comments below. What are you guys after? Are you guys going to be coming and grabbing some sublimation designs? Are you guys after, you know, stuff for your Cricut or Glowforge, maybe even Procreate? You guys are looking for some patterns or, you know, fonts or whatever. You guys definitely let me know. So check out this Christian one as well. Um, I really love our Christian ones. We have some really, really good stuff. Um, look at how cute this is. This sings to my soul. Um, I can't, I can't even speak today, but anyways, you know what I'm saying? This is so darling. Um, at, at justly love mercy walk humbly. I can't even speak today. Forgiven. Oh, so cute. Coffee mugs, t-shirts, all of the things. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and drop this down. I think I've went over all of these designs here and then I'll go ahead and do some explaining. I think we could probably go ahead if we have enough, we'll go ahead and start our first giveaway. Let's just roll that thing out there. I think we're ready. Sweet. Here we go. So we're going to go ahead and hit the draw button. Good luck to everybody. Um, we, this is for that $15 store credit. Now keep in mind that you won't have this out to your account until after the event because there's so much going on. So all you have to, congratulations, Leah Reed. Thank you so much for watching us over here on YouTube. All you simply have to do is reach out. Now we switched our email today. It is social, I believe, hyphen media hyphen team at designbundles.net to claim your award. Now you can definitely screenshot this, take a picture with your phone, um, come back on the replay. But like I said, those won't be added to your account until after our event. So congratulations. All right. So let's go ahead. And if you are you guys ready for another giveaway, if you guys are ready for another giveaway, I want to see some really fun emojis. So we're going to be doing some really fun Halloween mugs today. So I want to see all of those Halloween um, emojis down below. If you guys are one of our YouTube members and you have our fun crafty stickers, I want to see those down below as well. So if I get enough of those, we're going to go ahead and announce the next one. So while you guys are doing that, I'm going to go ahead and explain a little bit about our dollar event. So if you guys are new, like I said, this is a, a really big deal. We do it once a month on, well, we've now have a Saturday event too. So that way everybody from across the globe can participate. So there are two different events. This is our Wednesday. It's the last Wednesday of the month. And we go live at 10 a.m. Central Standard Time every month. So hit our notification bell down below. Set your calendars for this event. Because like I said, this is the time to stock up on your designs. Even if you don't, questions I get, even if you don't own your Cricut yet, but it's something you're wanting to get into or your sublimation printer, snag those designs because they're not going anywhere. You don't have to download them right away and you can download them as many times as you want to. Um, you could come back in a year and then be ready to use them. They're going to stay there for you forever, right? And our designs comes with a commercial license so you guys can make your products and sell them as well. All right, let's see. I think everybody's ready. So for the next one, I'm so pumped and I'm so here for this one. We're going to give away three months of our, um, so I believe it is our gold. So we're going to give away three months of our gold membership. So all you have to do is use um, hashtag mugs for this one. So we're doing hashtag mugs and you guys are going to have a chance to win three months free of our gold plus membership. So y'all guys use those down below hashtag mugs. Now, Speaking, I tell this all the time. I feel like this is a secret that does not get shared. And I say it all the time. If you guys are a plus member, where these say a dollar, if you are a gold plus member, you're getting them, I believe, for 85 cents because you get 15% off of all of your purchases, including our bundles, including Marketplace and all of those things. If you are a bronze or a silver, you're going to get 10%. So these are going to be 90 cents each. And no, it is not too late to sign up for our plus membership. So definitely check that out. All right. So I see all of those coming in. Make sure you guys are using that hashtag mug. So let's go ahead and get started. So let me share my screen again. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you guys how to use Canva to design these. So say, for example, I am using... 
um, I'm creating mugs today, but I don't want to waste paper. I want to be able to use all of this real estate. How can we get them all onto one page? I recommend using the free version of the Canva and all you simply have to do is do a drag and drop method and they're going to load right here. You can also click on upload files here and bring them in. It is so quick and so easy. And so let me go and show you a new page. We're going to hit add page. And then so whenever we go to work with these, we're simply just going to click on our design here and then size it down. So when you go to size this, you can see where that black wording is. That's where I can see my numbers. So with my mugs, I'm using the 15 ounce today. I don't like to go no bigger than 3.5 high. So I'm going to bring this guy down to probably about, yeah, 3.4, 3.5 up. I don't know, maybe 3.2. Yeah, there we go. And so then I'll move it around. So I'll just kind of figure out where I want these guys to go. So I'll go ahead and continue to do that. Like I said, I, this is my favorite time. So y'all can see I'm a little bit extra today. I'm so here for this. The dollar event gets me every time. I'm an add to cart kind of girl. So I'm just like add to cart. Are y'all like me where, okay, say I purchased 12 of them and I'm like, these are the ones I want. And then I come back later and I'm like, I don't know. I think I want this one and this one and this one. I, I can't. And then at the end of the day, you end up with all 42. If you're like me, raise your hand. I have a problem. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to go ahead and scroll through here. Let's see here. I'm going to go ahead and just continue to add these across the board. And then here in a minute, I'm going to let y'all pick which one. So y'all keep in mind. Also, if you guys have any questions about this event or anything I'm doing today, put it in all caps. It helps us because of all of the uh, comments that we do get in. If you put it in all caps, we can find those questions a lot easier. All right, let's see here. I'm going to bring this guy in just a little bit, paying attention to my width because that was a little bit wider. Um, and then I'm going to add a few more here and then I'm going to go ahead and get ready to show you how to print it. So I'm going to go ahead and bring this one in here. I may even bring that in just a smidge more. Now, one thing you may have noticed on this, so say, for example, I'm going to do it again. So if you find a design that has a lot of white space like this, it's going to go off of that. What I do is I just bring my sides in and cut it down just a little bit, if that makes sense. So I'm going to go ahead and bring this back. I already messed up my design. There we go. I love this one. Unfiltered poison for our coffee. So stinking cute. Makes a perfect um, Halloween cup there, if you will. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and bring that guy back down again. And then let me see. I think I've pretty much grabbed. I think I'll grab this one right here. This is the sticker, like I said. So let's go ahead and bring it down. All right. And then I may even one more time. I'm telling you, I'm all over the place because wide. I'm trying to pay attention to my width. So I want the width and the height to be no bigger than 3.5. So I'm really paying attention there. So all right, there we go. I was thinking with this one where it says, which better have my coffee. I'm thinking of putting this on the back side of my cup. Another thing that I was thinking too is inside of here, I could actually combine designs. Say I was combining designs. I would grab this design right here. I'd go to position and I think it already is moved to the front. Okay, let me do this. Let me position this backwards. So say I was layering these two, pretend it didn't have the background. I could do that right inside of here. And that way, whenever I go to print them, they were ready. All right, we're just going to roll. Let me add one more. Let me add this cute little guy right here. Look at how adorable this guy is. Oh my gosh. I love these guys. So cute. I feel like they have taken over, like I said, the world. Okay. So here we go. Once you have these sized out, I'm just making sure there's enough space going on. I'm going to go ahead and go to share and then I'm going to download it. You probably won't see once it downloads to my computer because it only allows so much. So this is downloading to my computer. Once you get it to your computer, say I have an Epson. I'm just going to go up to file. I'm going to go to print. If you need a mirror, mirror, obviously. Since I have a Sawgrass, I actually have a folder on my computer that says Sawgrass Smart Folder. I just drag and drop it right in there. And then I choose that it is ceramic mugs, which honestly, I think I left this on polyester. So <laughs> there is that today. You really do want to use. Let me go ahead and drop that screen really quick. I messed up. I dropped it too fast for y'all. I apologize. And if I'm going too fast, um, I do apologize as well. Sometimes I just get so, so excited. Um, and so I do apologize for that. Now, if you guys are watching this on the replay, you can actually slow it down. There is a gear down here at the bottom of the screen and you can either speed me up. I love watching videos in 2.5. I'm crazy, but you can actually take me down just a little bit if I'm ever too fast for you. All right. So y'all give me just a second. I am trying to get cancel. I'm trying to get, um, this to pull up. I've got to go over here to my Sawgrass Print Manager. I'm going to pull this guy back out of here and then I'll put it back in there because I 
I messed up. So y'all just bear with me for just a second to grab this. Like I said, you guys make sure you're using that hashtag mugs in the comment below because here in just a bit, we are going to get ready um, to pick a winner. So I think here we go. Nope, that's the first one I worked with. It's got to be, I must have lost this thing. Let me try to see if I can add it again. Nope, that's the first one I did. Let me download it again. Let me... Okay, I thought I did. Just like I said, ignore me for just a second. We're going to hit download, download again. There we go. Give it just a second. So my Sawgrass Print Manager, sometimes if it don't open for you, just go and make sure that you've already opened Print Manager for the day. Um, and that does happen from time to time. Oh, that's what I did. I didn't get a recent, recent downloads. Let me see if this is the one. Nope. <laughs> Let me go over here. This is what happens to me. I'm like, where did you go? Okay. It was saving under, that's what it is. Since I had two files, it was actually putting it in a folder for me. And I'm like, well, thank you so much, Canva. Aren't you just the best? All right, here we go. So we're going to change our substrate to ceramic mug. And then I know you guys cannot see this. I'll try to see if I can share my screen. Let me do that really quick. Let me stop this, share it, share my screen. Um, let's see here. Window print settings. All right, here we go. So let me go ahead and pull this up for y'all really quick. So once you guys drag and drop that over into your Sawgrass Print Manager, this is a question I've been recently getting is what settings am I using? So this is all I've been using to print with my, cr with my Cricut with my Sawgrass printer is that folder. So it automatically pops it up and brings me here. My mirror is already turned on. I go to my substrates. I choose whatever, whether it's polyester, ceramic mud, all of the things. I've chose that. And then what I do is I go to color. You don't have to do this every time. Once you have it set to this, it's going to stay there. So I change my color mode to vivid. So you may have your set to photographic. If you change it to vivid, those colors are going to be so much brighter than you've ever seen before. So just go in there and change those. And I promise you, you're going to be 100% happy. All right, so we are ready to go. You can go ahead and drop this screen because once I hit print, it's going to go away. So all right, so I'm going to go ahead and hit print. We're going to print this guy out. Now, I'm going to let y'all choose. So y'all go ahead. Let's start here. We have five coffee mugs. So we have a few options. I'm going to drop y'all down here really quick. We have a few different options. We have stirring the pot. This is my idea. I'm going to go ahead and put this on the front, this on the back. So if we want to use stirring the pot, right, uh, Let's just say green because this is green. So you guys can say green. Y'all can give me some sort of green emoji. Um, we can do that. We've got witch's brew. And then right now I'm, I'm doing the, um, what was that one? The unfiltered poison. We could do this one on the front and then unfiltered poison on the back. Now I'm going to do one on the front and back just so y'all can see some designs going on there. I've got these ones here, which y'all could put orange circles. If y'all want to see some of the gnomes going on, definitely tell me gnomes. We've got this spooky one. We've got the super cute purple truck. So you can say some pumpkins. I'll definitely know what you guys are talking about. Um, and then we are almost done with printing this one. So, oh, I see some green hearts coming in. So I'm with y'all. I think this one is going to be so cute on a mug. So we can actually start that one too. And then we'll get to this one right here. So I'm going to drop y'all down one more time because I'm going to now show you too one way to do this. And here's this one as well. Let me show y'all. So it allows us to print multiple on one page. And that way we're getting more bang for our buck with our real estate. I'm seeing so many of those greens. I'm telling you, I think those are going to be so cute. Those gnomes are good. So I see some gnomes coming in. Oh my gosh. So, so cute. Yes. Thank y'all so much for all of your help. So this is the deal. You can use your paper trimmer to kind of help you too, as long as like there's nothing in the way of these. You should be able to go in here and bring that down just a little bit more and get your paper trimmer in there. And then we can go back in once again and we can really go in between all of these just like this and kind of really cut those down. Now, if you really have yours in a twine, just use a pair of scissors and that's what I'm gonna do to finish cutting all of these out. So I forgot to grab scissors. I think I'll do these ones today. It'll be fine. <laughs> you know, Y'all let me know down below. I have about a billion scissors, but when it comes time to finding them, that's the problem. <laughs> I have at least three or four right now in this studio, and these are the only ones I could find. And that is not counting these. All right, so right now I'm just trimming these down. I do like to get a lot of this excess off because where I'm going to be lining it, just leaving a little bit of space. 
So I'm going to go ahead and finish trimming these. Oh my gosh, I see you guys. All right. I'm so, so excited for y'all. Now, like I said, I can't wait to go back home and see what you guys are snagging because when I get back home, I'm going to go back and read all these comments to see what all you guys are getting today. Also, let me know in the comments below, are you a Plus member? So do you get extra access? Um, are you thinking about signing up for Plus? Do you have any questions about it? Um, what I love about it once again, and I know I'm mentioning it, I love mentioning this on the dollar event because you do. I don't think a lot of people realize that you do save 10 or 15%, which makes this event even cheaper. So like I said, 85 cents, as low as 85 cents is crazy. We're giving it away for that. I mean, bundles for 85 cents. Oh my goodness. Plus you get 24 hours. Love it. All right, here we go. So we're going to go ahead and start with y'all already know we're doing the green one first because I've seen a lot of green. And while we're doing that one, I can go back and check. So I'm going to drop y'all down so we can put this together. If y'all have not made mugs yet, especially with a Cricut mug press, you're missing out. Let me go ahead and show y'all. So we're going to take these two designs here. Oh, they're darling. So cute. Now, when you're working with a mug here, you want to pay attention. Which one is the front? Which one is the back? So if I hold my mine in the right hand, I want to make this my front. Left hand, make this side your front, if that makes sense. You want to go ahead and clean. I couldn't find my rag. We're going to use our gloves here. We're going to clean this guy here. So this is my front. So I'm going to put stirring the pot. I'm going to use my scissors here to help hold this up a little bit more. Another thing that I do love to use, I'm going to show you all really quick. I talk about these all the time. Grab these squeegees here. They're like $2, a dollar something with the ones with the line. Because whenever you go to do stuff like this, it just holds them so nicely. It's a two for one. All right. So I'm going to take some tape here. Get my handy dandy tape expense, tape expensive, tape dispenser. <laughs> I love this one because it cuts everything down for you. It is the best. I snagged it on Amazon. And it's pretty cool because you can load multiple types of tape. Um, it's pretty neat. All right. So with these mugs, you don't have to go crazy. You don't have to try to tape the heck out of this. You just need some tape holding down that side and have some tape holding down this side. You just want to make sure it's nice and tight and that there is no gap there. And then we're going to go ahead and get this side. So when you're sublimating, you want to get both sides. All right. Here we go. And y'all make sure y'all are using that hashtag plus because as soon as I get this thing going, we're going to start that giveaway. So use those hashtag plus down below for a chance to win three months of our gold plus membership. And so here we go. So we've got this guy ready. So now what we're going to do is we're going to load this guy up into our mug press. And then we're going to hit go. So this mug press is designed to where we don't have to set the time. We don't have to set the temp. It has five little flashes, which is five minutes. And it's just going to do it for us. So while we're doing that, I love the heat tape. I'm going to go ahead and start to design our next ones. And I'll go ahead and walk y'all through my thoughts. And y'all let me know if I've got this correct. So I think, let's see here. I'm going to drop this down below. I think we're going to do the unfiltered poison. And maybe we should do it. Should we do it with one of the gnomes or something? Just so y'all can see a difference. Y'all can see the different ones. So maybe we can do this guy with this. Y'all let me know if this is okay. We can have some thumbs up going down below. And then which better have my coffee? I almost really feel like we should do this. I think it would be cute. And then let's see here. I'm thinking spooky. What if we did spooky with this one on the back? All right. So there's three because fours. And then we've got one more. And so, ooh, this one's cute too. Uh, don't be a basic witch. We could do that one, but I almost feel like we need to do this guy. So what if like these are his pumpkins in the truck, all right? These are his pumpkins. And then we have the guy that like, this is his truck, okay? Because the purples match. Y'all let me know. What do y'all think? Give me a thumbs up if you're happy with it. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. Okay, now going over, we've got our mug in here. You want to make sure you have some... Um, Heat gloves if you're going to be trying to peel it. Your handle does stay cool to the touch, but just to be safe, you can snag these. Um, I do have the Cricut pads, so I can set those. If you have, so that way you can protect your countertop. I've got a heat tape, a paper trimmer, and all the things. Now, we do provide a QR code over here. We have the QR code over here. And so if you guys want quick access to our dollar event, all you have to do is hold your camera up there um, and then it will open that site for you. You'll just click the link and it just gets you there pretty quickly. So let's see here. Do we want to go ahead and answer a couple questions while we're waiting? We're barely on the second beep or 
Are we ready for the giveaway? If we're ready to draw, if y'all are ready to draw this one, I want to see, give me some pumpkins down below. If we've got some pumpkins down below, we're going to be ready to draw the winner of this. I'm so excited for this because to get access to our plus membership for three months, talking outside of this event, y'all would not believe the designs that are in that plus membership. So when y'all are a plus member, you guys do get the plus credits, which I feel like are free files. I know you pay monthly for the thing, but these designs are phenomenal. Y'all would not believe the designs that are with the Plus membership. So for you to have access for three months, you're going to be obsessed. Okay, I see all those pumpkins going in. All right, so let's go ahead and get ready for that giveaway. Let's go and pull it up here. All right, let's see here. Dun, da, da, dun. We've got our hashtag mugs. We're going to hit that draw button here. Good luck to everybody. Once again, wait until after this event. You can go ahead and send it, but you may not have access to it till after the event. Um, so good luck, good luck, good luck. Congratulations, Beaten Tiger. I think I've said that right, Beaten Tiger. Thank you so much for watching us over here on um, YouTube. And all you have to do is reach out to social hyphen media hyphen team at designbottles.net. Now, don't forget, you just hit, a, take your camera out uh, or take a screenshot of this, come back, pause it, and then you can write that down. Um, so that way you can reach out, let them know that you are the lucky winner of our three months plus membership, and they'll add that to your account as soon as they can. Like I said, normally I tell you to message right after we're done and they add it right as soon as they can. Today is the event, so please give them a little bit of time. It could be at the end of the day. All right, let's see here. So we've got one more minute on this. So um, let's see, I was trying to decide, are y'all ready for another giveaway? Are y'all ready for this one? We're gonna give away all 42 designs. So you don't even have to buy these things today. We're gonna give them to one lucky winner. So if you want a chance to win all 42 designs, I want y'all to put 42 in the comment below. So put 42 in the comment below, maybe like a shocked emoji or something. I just drop them down below. If y'all are ready for that and y'all want a chance to win all 42 designs, drop that number 42 in the comments below so I know that y'all want a chance. All right. So while y'all are doing that, I'm going to give y'all a minute. Oh, I see those 42s coming in. Dun, da, da, da. I see. I see you guys. I'm so excited because it's kind of like an add to cart deal. You don't even have to think about it. You just get access to everything. Now, once again, Again, for whoever wins this, it will be after the event because they don't. We don't have access to theirs until after the event. Um, all right, I see them. I see those forty twos. Okay, so for this one, are y'all ready? Here we go. Use the hashtag party because today it's like a party. So hashtag party in the comments below for a chance to win all forty two designs all 42 designs. And we will announce that at the wind. It's good at the wind. We're going to announce that at the wind. We're going to announce that at the end of today's live. So that way you guys do have chance um, to win this 42 design. So here we go. Let's go and pull this guy out of here. Hashtag party y'all. Hashtag party because it's a party up in here at 10 o'clock in the morning y'all. All right. So I've got this out here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to set that guy aside for just a second and let's go ahead and start pressing our next one. Can we get a clock? I want to see a clock. How much time do we have left before our event? So, uh, let's see. Do, 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 do. I'm trying to decide which one to pick next. Let's go in. That's going to be greens. Let's go in with our oranges, this one. Okay. So, for this one, I'm going to go ahead. Once again, I need to clean my mug. I'm never prepared. All right. Here we go. 30 minutes, y'all. Y'all got 30 minutes. So, as soon as we are done with this, y'all are going to want to head straight on over. You're going to have an hour, unless you're a plus member, you do have extra access. Um, to the event. So that's super, super nice. That is like a luxury, super, super nice. So, um, so we've got 30 minutes. Oh my goodness. I'm having so much fun with y'all today. I'm trying not to, if y'all watch me on my Monday live, you know, I can't speak. And I feel like in the morning I've had my, I've had my coffee. And so I'm like, I'm living it up right now. I feel like I'm on Red Bull. <laughs> I'm so excited about this event. It's my favorite, y'all. All right, so I'm just taping these down. I'm not even showing y'all. And I hope this ain't too bright for y'all today. I think it's okay. And so the biggest thing is making sure we have them in the correct direction. I'm going to trim a little bit off there. And so this is going to show us an orange one. So I'm going to try to make as many mugs as I can while we're live. And in between, once I get this one going, we'll go back to the design so I can show y'all again. And then um, whenever we go to start our next mug, we'll start some Q&A. All right, so here we go. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to go. I see those hashtag parties coming in. All right, so I've got my cup here. All right, we're going to press it. Also, 
when you guys, okay, so y'all know when y'all are waiting and y'all get the 60 second clock before I go live. I feel like it just like listening to the music, like you just want to start dancing. Anybody else? It's just, I feel like we know that song by now. All right. So we've got that going. Let's go ahead and get our next cup ready just so it's ready. And then I'm going to start walking through some designs again. Okay. So this one, I'm going to do like a left-handed. So we're going to do, hmm. I'm trying to, okay, I've got an idea. Let's do this guy. So the little gnome guy, I'm going to do him on the front. And I'm going to do the truck on the back. So we're going to go ahead. I'll drop y'all back down below. All right, here we go. Dun, 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 dun. I am so here for this. Y'all guys know that I have been watching some Christmas stuff. So to be back over here at the Halloween spirit right now, I feel it. I'm just so, so pumped. All right. Oh, I have to tell you guys too. So I think next weekend, me and my husband are going to go glamping. I'll talk to you guys about it on the next live. So I'll give you guys all the tea of what we're doing, but I'm going to go glamping. So what it is, is it's a tent. Has anybody heard of this glamping? It's a tent that's already ready to go for you. And it's so, so cute. And so we're going to do some golfing and do some glamping. I'm so, so here for it. And so we're going to go like a Thursday, Friday, and uh, it's going to be so, so much fun. I had to tell y'all, but I'll give y'all all the tea later on that. So here we go. So I've got the coffee mug ready. So let's go ahead and switch back up. We're at two minutes on this one and we're going to bring back up. So I'm going to share my screen again. So y'all give me just a minute. Oh, glamping is awesome. Debbie, I hope you give me some information. Have you ever uh, went glamping before? My husband was like, you want to what? <laughs> all right, let's see here. I'm trying to pull back up in this. So give me just a second. I want to make sure I'm on the correct screen. Share. There we go. All right, so I'm going to pull back open our designs again. And we're just going to talk about them while we're waking. Love glamping. Has anybody, so have you went glamping before? I'm so excited for it. And then I'll show y'all pictures too. Like all, I'm going to take pictures. And if y'all want to, if y'all follow us on Instagram and TikTok, I could go ahead and share and maybe even do like a live if I can. And I'll show y'all like what it looks like up close. I'm so, so excited about it. All right. So going back over here. So I think we did a video with this one here. So inside of this one, oh, let me click it again. Inside of this one here is such cute stuff. So we do have, we always have, where's our cat stuff, right? We always have dogs. We need our cat stuff. So we got that this time. We've got some really cute cat stuff. And this one right here, if y'all did not see, I think it's at the house. Actually, I think I have it right out here. So I've done a, um, I've done a video with this one. Santa is coming and this was glittered. So I actually glittered that sleigh. Um, let's see here, even thinking outside of the box and putting these like on a tote bag, which can become a um, Christmas bag and all of those things, t-shirts, there's 150 designs y'all. So $4, you're going to get 150 designs in that one. This one's really cool too. We've got a 3d bundle. If you guys really like doing those 3d projects, look how cute these are. So going glamping, I need to make one of these. Oh my gosh, how cute. So if we go glamping, I think I'll make like an ornament with one of these to hang on the tree and I could go ahead and put like, you know, 2022 and stuff. That would be really, really cute. Oh my goodness, y'all. Look at how cute these are. Um, okay, this one, this is an add to cart. Um, so stinking cute. Look at that Santa. These would be perfect for Christmas cards. Um, these would be perfect for making the ornaments, like I said, the shadow boxes, you name it. Oh, I haven't really looked in this one yet. <gasps> Look at these for the coffee bar. We can make a sign for the coffee bar. Look at the little penguin. Oh my gosh, I can't get too excited. And then my glamping stuff, cute. Okay, so love that one. Let's see here. We've already made up our mind on that one. Um, let's see, just kind of going in here. Da, 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 da. Trying to see some that I have not went into yet, just to show y'all. We do have some breast cancer awareness stuff going on. You guys know it is, are we in October? Am I a day too early? We're not in October yet. Obviously, we're at the end of the month. So next month is breast cancer awareness month. So we do have that stuff for you. So this is perfect for creating those t-shirts and all of those things, the coffee mugs. Maybe you can gift this to somebody that you know. Um, I've also, I know some people that will gift these to um, like the cancer hospitals and stuff to pass out to people. I just think it's so, so darling. But I really do love that one as well. So snagging that guy for a dollar. Let me go and see if I can back back up here. I think, okay, here we go. Perfect. Let's see here. We are fixing to beep here. So um, we're almost ready for that. I'm trying to see. I know we've done some stuff out of this one. We've got some memorial stuff. That would be perfect for those glass um, 
those little glass, what do you call them? The little glass bricks thing. Yes, it's on my list as well. Oh my gosh, so, so stinking cute. We've done some stuff with this one and I believe I have that out there. So if y'all give me, once I switch this, I may go grab a couple things just to show y'all. Um, this would be perfect Halloween font. Halloween best font. All right. Let me drop this really quick. Let's come back up here. Um, let's see. Let me, there we go. Perfect. All right. Let's pull this guy out of here. All right. Let me go ahead and get a clock on the screen here. Let's double check and make sure we are good to go. We're going to get ready for a clock. And I think we had, a, yes, we have our next mug ready. I'm going to pop this in here. And if y'all bear with me for two seconds, I'm going to walk out here and grab some stuff. So hold on. Da -da -da -da. I had to get it. Here we go. Oh my goodness. Look at this. Okay. So here we go. I did this one. So this isn't that one I just showed you. And we glittered this Santa sleigh. So if y'all didn't see this video, you definitely have to check it out. So this is actually uh, paint. So I stenciled this on and then I did glitter. So I used, um, I believe we used Mod Podge and then we did some glitter there with this one. So stinking adorable. And then these ornaments right here, I do believe that we did some similar. So I think we did a different one, but it's the same thing. So what you do is you get these tiles right here. You get these tiles from Lowe's and then you're going to put those designs that are already sized out for you. And then you're going to put a little piece of ribbon. We do have, this will be t on TikTok or Instagram. So y'all keep an eye out for that. And then let me show you guys this one a little bit closer. <laughs> so cute, right? And I glittered that. So we just added some glitter. So we made a stencil with our Cricut and it's just so, so cute. I love it. All right, so now let's go ahead and peel these ones. I think these are probably ready to go so we can do that while we're waiting. So let me do this and I'll drop y'all just a second. I love the reveal, <laughs> the, real, the reveal is what gets me every time. All right, let's see here. I'm gonna go ahead and peel this really quick. Glitter makes the sign. Oh my gosh, I'm telling you, it really does. And have y'all seen too that people are making stencils with their adhesive vinyl and they're using them to put stencils like a little temporary tattoo. So say like at a fair or something like that. And they're using body uh, glitter glue with glitter and, and doing those as well. It's really cool. All right, let me drop y'all down below. And here we go. Dun, 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 dun. Look how cute this is. I love that green. It really does pop. So, so cute. So let's go ahead and take the back off of this one here. All right. This is where our weather, guys. I'm wearing a hoodie today because I thought it was fall weather. I woke up, it was a little bit breezy. And then I came to work and I'm burning up. It's like a firecracker. <laughs> All right, here we go. Anybody else having that kind of weather? Look at this. Is that not cute? Thank you so much, Brittany. Oh my gosh, look at this. I love it. I'm gonna bring y'all back up. So y'all can see really quick. Look, I think you guys can hopefully see. Doom, 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 doom. Look at this. So cute. Whoop it around. I love it. The colors on this is so, so cute. All right, so let's go into our next one. This one may be a, still a little bit warm, but we're going to roll with it. So if you do decide to do these, you just want to be safe and use your heat gloves. Now, I don't have my heat gloves on because this one is almost ready. So I'm going to go ahead and peel. We're going to drop you guys down for that big reveal. Oh my gosh, those oranges are so cute. Spooky. These would be great to sell, gift for somebody, or make them for your own. So cute. Because like I said, guys, our designs do come with commercial license. So keep that in mind. I'm watching from the steam room, and so I'm definitely burning up. Oh my gosh, I want to do a steam room. Let's see, Southern Utah, cooler in the morning, 90s. Oh, okay. I'm trying to decide, too, um, for my glamping trip. I'm going to go ahead and bring y'all back up. For my glamping trip, I'm trying to decide. I was thinking about doing like some leggings, but like the crop ones, and then maybe doing like a little sweater because it's supposed to be like 70, 72. I almost feel like it might be breezy that day. Bring y'all up here so y'all can see the colors a little better. So these two designs paired together, I thought went really, really well. You guys let me know as well. All right, so there's that one. So we're just waiting for this one. I'm gonna go do this really quick. All right, so we're gonna wait for this one because... Don't touch that. It's hot. <laughs> I have to tell my own self. Have y'all seen? It's like on TikTok where they're like, don't touch the bottom. And it's like the kids still trying to grab the bottom of this. Like it's hot. It's like a whole thing. If y'all haven't seen it, definitely check it out. That's me right now. Like it's hot still for us. All right. So we've got one more minute. So we'll let that kind of go. So while it's going, since we do have a minute, let's go and pop our screen back over here and I'll keep walking y'all through. So for the Christmas fonts, not only are you talking about Christmas cards, if y'all have not seen our Christmas card video where we did the foil, you can use the Cricut 
foil pen or you can use a We Are Memory foil pen. You can do some Christmas cards. We've definitely done that. This would be perfect for creating those, um, the doormats personalized with somebody's name. Um, so cute. So they show like this on a pillow, t-shirt, all of the things. These would be really cute. Now, don't just think about the Glowforge. With these, you can use like the wood veneer and all of that stuff with your Cricut as well. Kind of zoom y'all into these so y'all can see them a little better. We have the Santa sacks. We did do a Santa sack, I believe, on one of our lives a while back. So you guys can definitely check that out. And they're just so adorable. I think I lost one of my lights. <laughs> so um, it kind of freaked me out there for a minute. This one right here, we actually did a really cool thing from the Dollar Tree too. So it was, um, let me actually, oh, we're ready. Let me go ahead and pop this guy up here. All right, here we go. So I'm going to go ahead and set this guy out of our way. And you know, Crystal was not prepared. We're going to try to attempt. I'm trying to, I feel like we're on a challenge and I'm going to try to get all of these done before our live ends. So y'all wish me luck. Here we go. Uh, What was I doing? Oh, because I'm doing these two together. I already confused my own self. Here we go. We're going to do this on the side again. Let me drop y'all down. All right, I'm already ahead of myself. I definitely feel like I'm on a challenge now because I think we've got like maybe 20 minutes left. Here we go. So for this one, we're going to do the witch better have my coffee because, hey, we're talking about coffee here. And um, anybody else, let me let me know. What is your morning? Are you guys grumpy in the morning? Do you have to have your coffee before you can speak to anybody? Are you nice? Are you just nice and chipper and you're ready to go? So I think my husband, he's the chipper one. He's like talkative and like, let's do this thing today. And I'm like, hey, 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 let's, let's calm down. Let me have this coffee for just a minute and then we'll talk. So you guys let me know what type of morning person you guys are. Okay, here we go. So I'm going to go ahead and grab this tape. Don't forget, you guys do have a chance to win. If y'all are just now joining us, use hashtag, um, I believe it was, hold on one second. I have to ask my own self, hashtag party um, for a chance to win all 42 designs. We're going to pick a lucky winner at the end of this live. So definitely make sure you guys stay tuned for the end because you don't want to miss it. You won't even have to buy your stuff today. You're going to get it for free. Let's see, have to have my coffee first. Ah, oh, me too. I'm like, just let me chill for just a sec. All right, here we go. So I've got this ready. We are now going to go ahead and pop it in. Here we go. Dun, 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 dun. And we're going to drop it in. All right, so this one's going to go. We've got this one. We'll go ahead and reveal it really quick. And I know she's still fresh, but I think it's going to be okay. Peel these top two tapes. And we are ready. So let me go ahead and do this. And look how cute. Oh my gosh, the colors on that purple. I love how this black is written out there. It almost looks like it's hand done. Oh, so, so stinking cute. And it's bats, it's so cute. Y'all, if your weed and pen looks like mine, it's covered in paint. I use it for everything. It's not just for the Cricut. Here we go, let's see. I'm calm, but I'm happy. Let's see, I'm ready to go in the morning. Oh, you and my husband would get along great, Brenda. <laughs> Coffee first, Michelle. Oh, me too. Here we go. I'm good with or without coffee. Look at this gnome. How cute are these colors? And it don't do it justice. Sometimes I got to switch. Like, so let me pop it up here. So you guys can hopefully see these colors a little bit better. Uh, morning person here. And then we have our super cute gnome. I love this guy. The colors are so, so darling. I don't work well without coffee. Me neither. And that's where with glamping, it comes with like a little coffee machine. But I am stressing a bit because I want my own type of coffee. So I may bring, if it plugs in, I'm going to bring my Nespresso or Craig. So I'm also extra with coffee. So we're going to set this aside. We're going to wrap this last one. So hopefully we can beat the clock. We've got 15 minutes. I think we can do it. So we're going to wrap one more. So with um, the coffee, I'm stressing about that a little bit because I have to have my coffee. I'm extra. I have a coffee bar at the house. We have a regular coffee pot, which is a bun whenever we say regular. That's my husband's and my father-in-law's. And then we have the Krig and we have the Nespresso. So if I'm out of Nespresso pods, I use the Krig. Or sometimes if I'm just, you know, when you get burnt out on coffee, I'm like that. I have to switch it around. Anybody else? Um, oh, we got 15 minutes on the clock, y'all. 15 minutes, and then you guys will be able to head straight over there um, and snag your stuff. Now, don't forget, if you guys are new to this event, it doesn't matter if you have it in your cart. You have to completely be checked out before that hour, okay? Here we go. And then we're going to flip her over, and we're going to get the other side. I think you guys can still see me working from this angle. All right, we're good to go. Love that gnome cup. Oh, I love that gnome. I... Like I said, we don't talk gnomes in this state. <laughs> I can't, I hate to say the word. I feel like that H is coming down again soon. I temporarily fixed it. If y'all missed that episode, scared me to death. 
Let's see. Hello, pumpkins. My favorite. Mine too. I really like the font on that. Y'all let me so far. What is your favorite? I really like the green on this one. And I do love the font on that Hello Pumpkin as well. I'm trying to keep these in film. In film? In view? <laughs> what do you call it? All right. Let's bring these in. Try to be careful because they are still a little bit warm. I think y'all can see these hopefully a little bit. All right. So we've got this one ready. This one's got about three minutes left. So we're going to go ahead and pop back open. I think I can bring our screen back up. Let's see, these are so cute. Thank you so much. And honestly, um, I think we might even do Q&A while we're going through this. So if y'all have any questions, I think we could start popping those on the screen as well and trying to answer a few of those. Look at these shadow boxes. So like we did a, um, like, let's see, why are you using Canva? So you can, Canva is just a free program. It's one of our favorites. And I think it's a lot of people's favorites. And so you can use it completely free. And so it just makes it a whole lot easier. Now, if you guys are a Gold Plus member, we do have a program called Called Designscape, and you guys can use that as well. But I've been trying to teach with Canva because not everybody is a Gold Plus member, and I try to be mindful for that. So for this one, I would use parchment paper like I did in a shadow box um, yesterday, and that would be so good. Yesterday, Mondays, <laughs> that would be really good as well. This design is so cute. It's been one of my favorites. I've seen it pop up a few times, but I love the roses with the pumpkin. I really think that's cool. It would be cute as a crop top. So if y'all have those teens that are really love those, it almost gives me like a Rue 21 vibe or whatever, but um, it... Uh, it would be cute as a crop top too. Let's see. Does the Cricut hashtag most bug press only work with? Nope. You can use whatever mugs. As long as they are, I think 11, 12 ounces, 15 ounces, you are good to go. Now there is third parties that make the wraps that you can put in there to put other things, but I would only really recommend using whether they're 11 to 15 ounces in there and you're going to be good to go. All right, let's see here. Just kind of zooming across here, letting y'all see these while we work. Let's see, uh, hashtag mugs. How far do you need to be away from the handle? So let me go ahead and drop my screen really quick and I'll show you guys really fast. Here we go. So you guys can kind of see where I'm holding this part right here. It's a little warm. I've held it as long. That does get hot. So like right here, I'm going to drop the screen just to show you all a little bit closer. Just right here. My hands are all, it's weird trying to hold a mug like this. So this much right here. So you want to be about, I guess that would that be like a half an inch to an inch away? And you are honestly good to go. But if you want to be super smart, like I should be, I would definitely do this and you're going to be good to go. These are heat resistant gloves and you would have definitely, you could definitely even hold it like this for a little bit before you can kind of fill it through your gloves. So um, definitely make sure you're using those. All right, let me go ahead and pop this up. I think we're ready to pop this mug out and, and put in another. So we're going to pop it open. I just like it because you see how easy I didn't have to do my time temp. Now, if y'all have a mug press, like if you have like, for example, I have the seven and one tumbler press, you could use that as well, honestly, because once you've been doing these for a long time with something where you have to set the time and temp, you already know it's just changing it from, especially if it's one or the other, there is other designated mug presses out there too, with the time and temp, but I just love as a crafter, it takes the thought and effort out of that for us. All right, let's see here. Do we have any other questions while we're waiting? I'm gonna let that one cool for a second. Do you need to use butcher paper between the mugs? And No, you do not. So when I first started out doing this, now depending, I say that. Say for example, if you have an Epson and you're using too much ink and you're saturating the page, it may go through and at that point you may want to. But I'm using a sawgrass and I've done this for so long that I have found that it's just wasting parchment. So I'm definitely, I don't want to waste materials because the cost price goes up. So if you don't see it after a few presses, then definitely don't do that. Let's see here. Do we have, let's see, where did you get the awesome tape dispenser? So my tape dispenser here, I found on Amazon. If we don't have it linked down below, I'll do it after it. I did, but just type in sublimation tape dispenser and it'll pop up. What I recommend on Amazon, remember, there is prices all over the place. So definitely just try, buy, try to find the cheapest one because one may be $10 and another place it's $7. So definitely do that. They're all going to be the same, but you can get different colors, pinks, blue, purple, all of the things to match your craft room. And what's really cool is you can load two tapes here. So you can have double the tape and then you can have a long one. So I have this one here. It's just gold. It's just whatever. I can get a long piece of tape here and it was here like this, right? And it's all, <laughs> I get, I'll get it in a minute. <laughs> and so then you can twist this and it makes the cuts for you. It is so cool. I'm gonna drop it down and show y'all really quick. 
and then I'm going to obviously remove my tape. All right, here we go. So if you, you see that, so whenever I did it, it like, it cuts it for you. So you can have two of these going at the same time. Now it does come with a smaller one of these. So you can put the Cricut tape on there. So you can have one regular Cricut tape and then you can have the strong grip. Um, and then this guy right here, you could load that on there. It's really cool. It holds your scissors. It holds all the things you can access your blades here. Oh, it's so, so cool. Highly recommend, guys. All right, do we have any other questions? And I think we're getting down to, oh my gosh, the time. I feel like, oh my goodness, we have two left. We're down to like nine minutes, y'all. Oh my gosh, let's fill this one really quick. Here we go, because we still got our giveaway and I've got to make sure I let y'all guys go just in time. So let me peel this one and we can go ahead and pull nine minutes left, guys. We're going to peel this one and then we'll be ready. I'll have to peel that one hot. Yes. Da, 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 da. Look at that, so cute. I feel like I've got, I don't know if it's my camera angle there. It may be. Does that seem like, I can't see it in this angle, but this angle, it almost seems like I got her skirt a little washed out. Uh, so I may not have had a good press on my paper. We'll find out when I get to this other camera. Just give me a second. Here we go. Sometimes I can't tell with my studio lights. Let me go and pull this one off. Here we go. Da -da -da. Which better have my coffee. How cute. Perfect for Halloween. And then obviously having the little legs on the back. This would be cute too to really size it out to where her skirt goes all the way up here and then her feet. Or you could even have it where she's upside down and have her feet going up. So it's almost like a, what do you call that movie? The Wizard of Oz. Um, so it would be like the Wizard of Oz. So like she'd be under the house. So I almost want to flip that. I really wish I had thought about that and had it upside down to where her body is underneath my mug when I'm drinking. I think that would be cute. But let me bring this up. Let's see if we can see together. If this is washed, it looks black. So I think it's just my camera angle, honestly. So you guys can see that there. It was just my camera angle. All right. So here is this one. So stinking cute. All right. So we got that hashtag party, y'all. We're going to be drawn here in a minute. So we've got one minute. Let's go ahead and do a few more questions here. What else do we have? Dun, 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 dun. Let's see. What type of tiles were you using? So at Lowe's, you can get, let me see. Hold on, y'all. Here we go. Dun, 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 dun. This is, she's a mess, but I, I can pull things out quick. So the tiles look like this. You know how you can go buy the packages like this? You're looking for these. The, you can find white. I didn't find mine's like a almost like a very light hint of a gray, but they'll look like this, and you're just gonna pull them off of that netting. And so um, we have them sized out for you and we do have a really big bundle with those. So definitely make sure I'll check them out. Let's see here. We're fixing to beep. Do we have any other question? Okay, let's see. Do you put anything on the mugs? No, they're going to last forever. They will outlast the, the mug if the mug breaks. You can put these in the dishwasher. You can hand wash them. You can do all the things. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and lift this up here. And then we're going to go ahead and start to peel. This one I'm so excited for because this is the unfiltered poison. I'm so excited for it. It's going to be so cute. All right. And we are getting down to some time. So I'm trying to beat the clock because we still got a giveaway. Look at that. Unfiltered poison. So stinking cute. And then on the back, we have our, we're going to say he's our crazy scientist guy, right? Here we go. How cute is this guy? Look at his little eye. I mean, it's so darling. I really, really love that. And then with that unfiltered poison, so stinking cute. So y'all have got to check these out. I think y'all can see my mugs. I'm gonna bring this one back in so we can see everything. And then we're gonna answer a few more questions and we're gonna get ready for that giveaway. I wanna make sure I can send y'all over. So there we go. So y'all can see those mugs. We have made, what, five mugs live? So, so cool. Here we go. So let's go do a few more questions. Can you use any sublimation ready mugs in the press? Yes. So you can use whatever brand you would like. Whatever one is your favorite. You don't have to use the Cricut, especially if I was selling them. These have Cricut on the bottom. I wouldn't want that. I would want my own logo. I'd want them to be plain because I wouldn't want to sell this on my marketplace and then have Cricut on the bottom. All right, let's see here. What else do we have? What is the best printer for sublimation? I always recommend, I have the Sawgrass SG500 as well as the 1000. I would start out with that Sawgrass SG500. You can definitely convert an Epson. A lot of people have success with those. If it's something you use every day, you're going to be fine. So those lines don't fog, but uh, user-friendly, it is going to be a little bit more expensive, but it comes with the ink. It comes with the paper. I'm always going to recommend that Sawgrass SG500. So five minutes, guys, five minutes. Dun, 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 dun. I'm so excited. 
All right, so let's go ahead and see. What printer would you recommend for sublimation for a beginner? 100%. When I started out, like I said, I know I tell, I feel like I tell you all this all the time. I started out in about 2016 or 17. I went straight for that Sawgrass SG500 because there was nothing else anyways. It was an investment, and I was scared when I first started teaching it. I thought nobody's people, you know, crafters, but it is a huge success, and it's outlasted me. So I have upgraded because when I first started, it was a Sawgrass SG400 because it did not have Wi-Fi. I've had mine for years, and I have not had any clogged lines. If it does have a few specs, I do a clean, and it's good. My ink lasts forever. I just highly recommend it. All right, let's see here. Are those mugs Al Dollar Tree. No, these are actually Cricut mugs. The Dollar Tree mugs, you cannot sublimate unless you put a special coating on them because they are not poly ready. All right, let's do a few more. We're going to get ready for that giveaway. So make sure y'all guys are using that hashtag party. Where did you purchase the pink squeegee from? So these right here are actually from 143. You can purchase them on Amazon as well. So a few different brands. I think even, um, I think even Silhouette has a white one that looks like this. So, um, but I want to say we have linked you guys to Amazon as well, but 143, um, Amazon, I, there's a few other places too. I can't think off the top of my head, but yeah, you're just looking for those two lines. Let's see here. What else do we have? Is there a video to learn how to use design space? Yes, we actually have several of those. We will have some more coming out soon that are just designated. I need to do an updated font. I need to do an updated uploaded video, uh, uploaded files and all that. So stay tuned. But we do have some on the channel as well. Let's see here. What else do we have? Um, it, okay, I've already got that. I think, let's see, can you use the heat and strong tapes or is it better than the other one? Um, so... I do. So you do have to use the ones for sublimation because they're heat resistant. I wouldn't waste your money doing the Cricut Strong Tape if that's what you're talking about. It, it, you don't need all that. So I think that was our last question. So let's go ahead and get ready for our giveaway. We're going to do that. And then before I let y'all go, I'll run through this deal one more time. So let's go ahead and get ready. Are y'all ready? Because I want to make sure I have enough time to send you guys over. Don't forget, you guys can click Use your camera for this QR code right here. Um, and that is going to give you guys straight access to our dollar event. So if y'all want to use that, you can definitely do it. So we're going to go ahead and hit draw here. Good luck to everybody. Don't forget, this is for a chance to win all 42 designs. And um, this we can't add these to your account until after the event is over. So congratulations, Stephanie. Do for, I think I'm saying that right. Um, congratulations, Stephanie. Thank you so much for watching us over here on YouTube. Um, all you simply have to do is reach out to social hyphen media hyphen team at designbundles.net. Uh, let them know that you are the winner. You can screenshot this, take a picture with your camera, like I said, come back, rewatch it again, um, and reach out and let them know that you are the lucky winner of all 42 designs. So, guys, y'all get over there, snag your stuff. Like I said, if y'all are not a Plus member, you have one hour to snag everything that you guys need. Um, make sure you guys completely check out. And sometimes when you get through that checkout process, there's a few extras that pop up that you guys can snag as well. So pay attention for that. Um, and then, like I said, if you guys are a Plus member, you guys do get that extra access. Just don't forget to check out within the 24 hours. And you do get that extra percent off. And it is never too late to sign up for that Plus membership before the event. Okay. So I think that was everything. I'm so, so excited that you guys joined us here today. We made five mugs live and I'm fixing to go snag me some designs. So I'm going to catch you guys on the next one. I'll see you guys next Monday. Bye for now.